in his region. And Dwayne Shields. Now, Dwayne is kind of an interesting study in alcohol dragster racing. The driver of the muscle milk car, he lives in Las Vegas. But the race team stays out on the East Coast, and he actually claims the Eastern region. So while Booker is running for the North Central team, Dwayne is running for the Eastern region team, even though he lives in Division 7. Traitor, traitor, traitor. No, I'm sorry. That's a lot. Dwayne, former world champion in the category. Mike Booker, he is a heck of an inspirational story. His plan was to go top fuel racing a long time ago and follow in his father's footsteps. His father, unfortunately, passed before Mike was able to get the opportunity, before he was old enough. But it's something he never gave up on. He is a pastor. He deals with a lot of youth that are coming from troubled backgrounds. One of the programs he's heavily involved with is called Hope Over Heroin. And basically, he talks to kids and says, look, don't make a bad decision once. Sometimes that one bad decision is impossible to recover from. He's a family man and a very well-spoken and very religious man. The racing pastor, is racer pastor is what it says on the side of his car down there. And he raced his way to a division championship. So if he'll tell the story. He's following the plan that he and his father laid out just 40 years down the road. That's your new number one qualifier, Julian Atas, over there on the return road as they go back to get ready for round number two. For a berth in the semis here at the Jegs All-Stars, Booker in the left side, Shields in the right side. They're ready. And Dwayne Shields drives into smoke. Booker gets the tried to pedal it, and no, 588. 232 miles an hour. Hey, sometimes the way you win is don't give up. And Booker, 588 at 232. Dwayne smoked the tires very early. And I guarantee you he was in there watching Mike going, okay, that's over. And then he saw Mike get in trouble. He tried to get back on the gas, but his car pulled the tire loose again. And at that point, there wasn't much he could do except watch Mike race his way into the semifinals and add points for the North Central. Final pair, winner of this one, will race Mike Booker in the next round. And it is going to be the former number one qualifier. I'm sorry, the former, the quickest blown car on the.